I clapped in cheeks for you, senpai. <laughs> One more time. One more time, please. One, One more, time, more time. time. Okay. Oh, yes. Oh. Oh my uh, god. I'm blessed I hate by you. the gods. I'm blessed I hate by the you. gods. I hate oh, you. Stop that. No. <laughs> I'm blessed by the gods. <laughs> god. Oh my god, I was just remembering this anime. Oh my god, I have too many references oh for those jokes. <laughs>
if I choose set A. I have to choose set A. I could also choose set B if I really wanted to, and it would be vice versa. We decided that would be the fairest thing to do since, um, again, we didn't want the person in second getting screwed over by trying to search for five minutes for one single encounter. You know what I mean? Because, like, we felt like in the first two seasons, Gizmo both times got really screwed over by that. So That's true. Um, we decided that that would be the most fair way to do it. And then we would both decide, like, based on encounters, like, should we try to get this? Should we try to not get this? What should we do? Blah, blah, blah. We felt like that would be the fairest way to do it. Hopefully that makes a little bit more sense. Again, I think the more the series goes on, it'll make more sense after that. Um, again, you can also tell this isn't scripted either. So my apologies for sounding stupid. Uh, anyways, uh, Gizmo, do you have anything to add to that? Uh, I mean, well, Goki is, al is already stupid as it is, you know. Can't blame him. You know, Can't you're, blame you're him. Not, you're not wrong there. You're not wrong there. <laughs> He's a baka. Baka. <laughs> I'm a baka. <laughs> too much anime. I've oh been watching God. too much, man, for my own Yeah, game. no. This man's vocabulary is like half anime. It which literally is. Also is. I kinda bring up. <laughs> That's also something I wanted to bring up as well. Like the, Even like the freaking series itself is like... We started off a Sword Art Online thing because Gio was on a Sword Art Online binge. During that, during that time period, I was <laughs> during, into Sword yeah, Art Online. We recorded the entire we recorded the entire series in like four days, um, in December. Yeah. Um, and so <laughs> this Gio was on like his Sao binge during that moment. So that was just really just to keep you guys a little bit more updated, ever since December, I've binged about twenty more anime since then. Oh my god! So um, <laughs> what's happened to my brain? This man binged one piece in like two months how do you do that i don't I, I, understand I mean, I, it's my vacation i mean i'm gonna go back to school literally two days from now from this recording so oh really I didn't yeah anime that. is gonna be be gone for a while so my binging is gonna be over but before That's we get sidetrack uh, side any, any longer uh going back to what goki was talking about the rules explanation so for this season three of souling versus the only thing that's changed was the way our versus aspect was going to be implemented. So yeah. for the previous two seasons, as Goki mentioned on episode one, so if you guys have not checked it out, so you could understand the context a little bit more, definitely go ahead and check that out. And so yeah. what we decided to do was remove the, the wheel. Now in this wheel, we would basically get some lifelines of detriments every single time we would beat the gym leader. But over the course of that last two seasons, we saw that it was a little bit complicated and it was just too much. It wasn't too much for us to handle. We just wanted to make it as simple as possible so that the audience could enjoy it as well. So what we decided to do right. for season three was to remove the wheel altogether and just come up with a simple system. And that's where we just kept the same Soul Link rules as they usually are on YouTube versus the only thing that we changed was ex it was kind of like getting a, an extension pack, right, Gokis, to go into the semi-islands? Kind of, yeah. <laughs> it was kind of like a kind little of, extension yeah. pack. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I think I think there are some Soul Links and some versuses that do require you to go to Sevi Isles. Uh, spoiler alert, we, are, we did decide to go to the Sevi Isles. Um, mm -hmm. During the verses, so we will be going to the Sevi Isles. Both of us, that is a requirement. So, so um, be looking forward to that. Um, that that does not <clears throat> mean me. if we made it there or not. <laughs> that does not mean we made yeah, it there. Yeah, that does not mean not. we made it there or not. That does not mean we made it there or not. I could be completely lying. You are correct. Goki could question. totally just lose it out of nowhere. I could totally just. I could totally just one hundred percent lose. I could totally just one hundred percent lose. That is very much possible. <laughs> it's only Gizmo too, technically. Gizmo could get walled by a dark type. You never know. <laughs> don't don't. We don't talk about that. Okay, Goki. Don't we don't spoil next week's episodes. Don't spoil next week's episodes. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. My bad. But yeah, that's pretty much what I really wanted to just add on to the rule explanation. So nothing much yeah. has changed. Just the aspect that we removed the wheel altogether and we implemented this new encounter with Goki just mentioned earlier so that it's pretty much fair game for either one of us yeah. to get early encounters. And it's it's a little bit more of a strategy based game now since it's a, with the yeah. versus aspect involved. So it's less luck and more strategy based. Pretty much, and go. Which is, why, I, I, which is the whole reason we started doing like a selling versus aspect. So that way, because like something that I've always not liked about watching a versus is if somebody gets like a super overpowered team and the other person's just screwed. That's something I, I've never really enjoyed. So like that's um, coming up with the selling versus is a lot of fun in that regards because mm -hmm. we're required to work together while also fighting against each other. It kind of provides that aspect. So you have to you have to go a lot of strategy based. Mm -hmm. um, you have to, it's a lot more based on strategy. You, like you have to plan out your encounters. You have to plan out what you want on your team. You have to work with your opponent. Um, that's a big reason why we did it. So it, it's really complicated. And again, this is more ex experimental. This is a much more experimental series mm -hmm. than what we've done in the past. 
but um, hopefully you guys enjoy it because Gizmo and I both absolutely love doing this series. So it's it's great. Yep. If you can't tell um, by the opening, uh, I lo- see, I've been watching too much happen- animes. I'm just calling them <laughs> openings now. So if you guys like haven't seen the intro, the layouts, and the outros themselves, they've all been inspired by anime in one way or the other so i've really worked it this series to kind of seem like 2021 art style in a way so even yeah. though i actually did finish everything in 2021 so <laughs> a shot yeah. that i t- put that plug in there i guess yeah you yeah. had to put the plug in there um but yeah and, and a way to just wrap up the rules it's in a simpler and it's like a simple way it's basically if you combine the selling rules and versus rules combine the two and then just have that extra added encounter rule um, that's basically what the sewing versus is. But if you're still kind of. confused, you will, you, uh, as the series progresses, you, it it'll be, sense. it'll make all the more sense. And yeah, it'll, it'll make a lot more sense. So if you're still stuck, don't worry. As the series progresses, it's just going to make so much more sense. So, yeah. And I think, um, I haven't even talked to Gizmo about this yet, but I had the idea of like, Whenever somebody beats the um, gym, we can like put up a we can put up like an image of like the encounter areas we can choose from for each segment uh, we beat. So um, we could do that as well. So that way people are like less confused, and then like I, we could be like Goki gets chooses this area, Gizmo gets this area, kind of thing, or like Gizmo gets this area, Goki gets this area, whatever. You know what I mean? Oh crap! Actually, I didn't even think about that. Yeah, that, that, might, actually... that might help as well. That might help as well. So like, Ooh. so again, it'll make more sense as the series goes on, and, you, and like, hopefully, anyways, crossing fingers. Again, like I like we said, this is a very experimental season um, because we felt like seasons one and two were like they were great series, obviously, but they were definitely a lot more beta um, mm-hmm. than this series is. I think this is by far like with the series we feel the most confident in terms of like commentary, how the layout looks, um, the intro, outro, stuff like that. So we, we really love this series a lot. Oh, yeah. I'm actually going to move my microphone a bit closer. So hopefully they'll keep my audio a little bit lower on my mm-hmm. audacity. Hopefully that'll help. Crossing <laughs> fingers. Fingers um, crossed. <laughs> fingers crossed, man. It's so annoying. It's it's so annoying. I hate it so much. The reason Just why stop. I'm laughing is Goki is literally on my end, on Discord, is literally going from like, yo, 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 and then, oh, yo, 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 yo. <laughs> like, literally, as he's getting louder, and then he's getting quieter, and I'm just like... <laughs> Okay. Yeah, I don't know why it does that. It's so annoying. I don't get it. If somebody can tell me in the comments, please, I beg of you, tell please me. Please help this guy. Please. I don't know how to, I even looked it up. I can't figure it out. <laughs> I can't figure it out, and I hate it so much. It's so annoying. Oh, my God, um, Goki. Uh, but anyways, uh, with all that being said, I think that explains the rules a little bit better. So do you want to go ahead and talk about um, the episodes one by one? Uh, so before actually before uh we start the episodes, I really want to give a couple of quick shout outs uh to everyone okay. being Goki himself because he actually commented on one of my episodes. Shout outs to Goki. Hey, yo, um, yo. not shout outs to that hashtag Team Goki. I don't know about that one, Road Chief. I don't know about <laughs> no, that no, one. No, 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 no. Hashtag I'll delete. I'll delete that real quick. I'll delete what? that. What? Nah. What? what? No! Don't do that. <laughs> shout outs to also. That. Uh, a couple other people who have uh, come out on my side being Spotty D three two one. I think Amelia was one of them. Ami- Emily. 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 Yeah, Emily. Shout out to Emily. Uh, also, shout outs to Team Major Me- Melon, I think, or Mulan. Yeah, Team Major Melon. Yeah, they, there you go. Both Emily and uh, Major commented on my channel as well. Gotcha. So, and then I was thinking we could the read one... some of the comments as well because some of these comments are amazing. So gotcha. And one more final like shout out to our OG friend uh, Goki knows him as well hey rising fire blaze, fire blaze. right yeah let's go shout outs to my boy thanks Woo! to thanks to you guys for coming on these episodes and liking them it's really a, i really appreciate it we appreciate it so yeah we really do and i was that. thinking we could read some of the comments as well so do you want to go ahead and do that before we talk about the episodes uh that does yeah let's let's go ahead okay. and do that so, uh, the first comment I wanted to read from my channel is, uh, hashtag Chihuahua <laughs> from the Gizmo GX himself. <laughs> uh, that was great. So from here on out, it's going to be spoilers th- of the actual episode. Oh, yeah, so if you territory. guys have not spoiler checked territory. the episodes out, definitely go ahead and check it go out. Go do it, cowards. But yeah, we, we brought up hashtag, just, I don't even remember what the joke was. We just brought up, like, comment hashtag Chihuahua. So Gizmo Actually, commented hashtag Chihuahua. I remember Chihuahua. this episode. This is, uh, episode one. I think it was, like, the beginning half. Yeah. And we... We yeah. were 
calling each other out. I don't know what I was calling you, but for whatever... Re- oh, yeah, you were asking me. I was like, oh, I don't know what you want me to refer to you as. Gizmo oh, or yeah. Goki or whatever, right? And then I was like, okay, I'm cool with anything. And I said it to everybody. It's cool. You can call me whatever you yeah. want. Just don't refer to me as an animal. And then you just see your Goki in the background. It's like, okay, <laughs> hashtag Chihuahua. You're the Chihuahua <laughs> now. Hashtag Chihuahua. The- <laughs> I remember. Yeah, I remember that now. My God, that was gold. That was comedy gold. I had to do it. I had to do it to him. I had to do it to him. You know what I mean? You Oh, I called you a chihuahua. It was beautiful, man. It was it's beautiful. beautiful. I had to do it. Had to do it. Um, let's see here. Another comment was from Team Major Melon, actually. Loser's challenge is watching an anime. This is a winner's challenge. Woo! <laughs> oh, man. My God. Well, you see, you underestimate the ability of watching YouTube because mm. I like watching YouTube. That is my, <laughs> that is my tea, that is my, that is my coffee. That is my thing. I like watching YouTube. All yep. day, it's great. If I had, if I had the option, I would watch YouTube all day. Can you stop adjusting the stupid audio on SD? I hate your guts, my God. Sorry, I just peek in that one segment for some reason because it goes up like. They have marriage stop, problems stop now. Stop it! Yes, I do. Hashtag That's marriage problem. problems with audacity. Hashtag marriage problems with audacity. Hashtag yeah. audacity. We 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 need to have a talk after this recording, okay? <laughs> oh. Um, but anyways, that that was a comment. Uh, so yeah, the the reason was like that is also because uh, another reason too is because it's kind of become a meme now where I don't watch anime and like everybody I talk to is a weeb because like Emily's a weeb, Monk's a weeb, everybody I talk to is a weeb. Like, mm-hmm. Gio's like, is most very much a weeb, obviously. He's the biggest <laughs> weeb I know. Um, which Emily, I told Emily about it, and Emily was like, yeah, no, he he's, he, should, he can't be a bigger weeb than me. I was like, no, you, you do not know this man. <laughs> you don't know this man. <laughs> but, um, yeah, no, it's kind of become a meme at this point. So, you're like, we thought it'd be a fun thing to be like, um... Gogi's losing challenge is watching an anime. And it worked! <laughs> Everybody's like, hashtag Team Geo. I'm like, what the frick, man? Yep, Come on. yep, I love it. I love it. I love uh, it now. It's funny. I we told go actually me and Goki, before we actually uploaded the series started uploading the series, we were talking about everybody's gonna be Team Geo once they hear anime as it loses challenge for Goki. They knew that. Yeah, exactly. I knew that. We knew that. <laughs> exactly. Like who wants to see TikTok dances? <laughs> actually, the surprisingly enough. I don't. I know we did talk about the me doing TikTok dances, but I didn't remember ten. I was like, whoa, whoa. When did I agree to ten? I was like, oh, but I'm cool with it. <laughs> I thought that's what we agreed to. I you remember. Out now, coward. I was like, short term memory. I was like, I'm cool with ten TikTok dances. <laughs> I'm cool with it. If uh, I lose, if I lose, yeah. if you lose, <laughs> you know, Goki. I mean, I mean, basing on episode one and our starters. I- Maybe yeah. in my favor. Which actually something I wanted to talk about as well. Because um, Emily said um, something about... Go- oh, yeah, here's her comment. Has, uh, Temple of Team Geo now. Can't wait to see you watch an anime. Definitely agree with Sword Art Online as the first anime. But Oberon, I am very sad <laughs> because I named my rival Oberon. Uh, though Death Note would be a good choice too as it's 24 episodes long. Which I'm definitely down with. I really want to watch... De- Death Note is one that I eventually do want to watch. So I'm definitely down with that. Mm-hmm. Um, then she says, Good luck, but I think it's over with you having a lot of... Sorry, Goki. You see, Emily... I just went really quiet there. I apologize. Uh, freak you, Audacity. Um, you see, Emily, the thing is, you underestimate my Pokemon playing abilities, and you underestimate Latias' terrible move set in the beginning of the game, oh. which Gizmo can talk about as well. Oh no! <laughs> I'll no. let Gizmo talk about that little thing. <laughs> yeah. Um. Uh. Yeah. Actually, I'll talk about it as the episodes progress when we're talking about the episodes themselves. But yeah. Okay. Sounds good. Yeah. I, I meant like for the first four episodes, because like all you know is like Psy Wave, right? Yeah, I only know Psy Wave. That's that's it until level twenty. Until level twenty, yeah, I get until level like, twenty, and then you get Dragon Breath, and then that's pretty much what Goku and then, was then worried about. It might be a different story. Then it might be a bit different story. So it comes down to if I can get a big enough lead, um, to stay in the lead for as long as I can during that segment. So or like if I can get my Pokemon to a decent level and evolve them and get more boo sets by the time you get a Latias with Dragon Breath. So mm-hmm. um, that was kind of like a strategy we were talking about as well. Which, again, that's a big reason why we started doing this only versus. Because even like then, you know, it's it's interesting. It's really cool. So, mm-hmm. uh, let's see Actually, here. A response to Emily's comment Goki's- as well. A response to Emily's comment as well. Sorry, I just wanted to say this real fast. But um, mm-hmm. uh, Alex the Dumb says, Fairy tale first anime, that's final. I don't know about that one, Chief. <laughs> Ooh, I don't know about that one. Fairy tale. I don't know, we'll we'll I don't know about that one either. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. We'll see, Actually, man. From Goki's comment section, they mention a lot of animes, uh, one of them being Sword Art Online. But I'm surprised, even though I've watched a lot of anime, I have not watched any of the ones they de- they mentioned, such as, like, Obreon, I've never heard of it. Magi, oh, that, that, I think... Uh, 
The um, uh, Emily was referring to the character overall from Sao. Oh, 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 okay. Oh, jeez. Oh, <laughs> oh my god, I feel like bad. I don't. Know. <laughs> Get exposed. Oh, I'm exposed. I'm exposed. Get exposed. Not a true fan. <laughs> actually, there's other that's enemies funny. out here, like Magi. I've never heard of it. Demon Slayer. Actually, that's the third anime I'm going to watch once I'm done with these two that I'm currently watching. I'm going to go ahead and watch Demon Slayer. Demon Slayer finally. I'm 100% down with, actually. I'm 100% down with Demon Slayer. Now, Assassination Slayer from Classroom. Cool. I've not. Uh, are you looking at that comment as well? Uh, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, Assassination I I Classroom. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Never heard of it. Yeah. Mob Psycho, heard never heard too. of it. I've heard I've heard Assassination Classroom and Mob Psycho are pretty good. I don't know about first anime good, uh, but I've heard they're good. I think Magi is um isn't it that magical girl one where it's like the um there's like that has that cat creature and then like she gives the girls she gives girls magical powers but then they become witches or something like that. Or something weird. I think that's Magi. It's like Magi Magico Magica or something like that. Oh, I just saw I've it. Heard I've heard it's popular, that's all I know about it. Uh, and oh, that really? might not even be it, but that's just what I've heard. Yeah. Ooh. Shout out to Watch Mojo for educating me on anime. <laughs> Ooh, I have not watched it. I know basically anime. all the I know basically all the anime spoilers now. <laughs> <sighs> Goki just gets spoiled and spoiled, you know. It, it sucks get to get spoiled. spoiled. See, I never thought I would actually watch anime, so you know. <laughs> watch Mojo.com and then like three years later now you're we're making you watch an anime. Now in terms yeah. of first anime, I don't know about Fairy Tale. I've watched Fairy Tale at least the first 15 episodes and that was so long ago and i just gave up on it so yeah see it's like the only thing i've heard from fairy tale from my friends is like half of them say it's really freaking good the other half of them say it's really freaking bad so i'm like <laughs> i don't know if it's good or bad i'm just going to sit here and listen to you two argue <laughs> right i mean of course i mean of course emily who says fairy tale is really good also says my hero academia is bad so i very i'm questioning her opinions on anime but because <laughs> i've heard my hero academia is really freaking good and it seems like an anime i would enjoy but <laughs> point this <laughs> roasting emily aside <laughs> emily and i are good friends in case you're wondering but yeah, i actually reason, haven't seen hero academia. academia yet i have not watched that yet I've heard it's good, so I don't know. I don't know why they. I, I don't, I don't know, know. Compared to One Piece, I don't know, man. One Piece is like a very high bar for me. Like nothing has yeah. passed. Nothing thus far, like up to this point of all the animes I've watched, nothing has passed One Piece, like at yeah. all for me personally. Yeah. There probably is. I just don't remember. I've watched like a lot of animes. Don't remember the names, but I if I yeah. see the title or at least the. I guess the an image of it, I'll remember the anime and kind of remember the backstory. But up to right now, yeah. I don't know any anime that tops One Piece. That's just my yeah. personal opinion. <laughs> so it sucks because I feel like I would really enjoy One Piece as well, but it's so daggum long. I'm like, I don't want to have to spend like three years of my life just watching One Piece. You know what I, I mean? did it in two like, months. I don't want to do that. <laughs> I did it in two months. Well, I mean, yeah, I get that, but you're a weeb. I'm not a weeb. I'm not a weeb gizmo, and I have I have YouTube things to watch. Let, to, just to give you a little bit of context of, uh, w during the time I was watching One Piece, that was literally I think it was like my fifth anime I've watched. So I was like going from like mm. uh barely getting to this anime and then getting thrown one thousand episodes in one go. Yeah, that's yeah. why I went bad bad way to go <laughs> get into this anime. But One Piece is definitely a shout. At first, yeah. you might not like it because of the animations and stuff, but as the story progresses, it just gets better and better and better. That that's all I can say about One Piece. Uh, yeah. but yeah, uh, <laughs> I have been, like, again, we've been that's talking. What, that's what I've heard, and I love like the uh, I love like the like the idea of like Devil Fruits and stuff like that. You know, like that sounds really cool. I mean, it seems like the story is like really really good, but um, at the same time, it's like a thousand episodes. I I, I don't I. I I'm sorry. I just don't want to do that. <laughs> it is super long. You know I mean? It is. Um, let's see. The final comment I wanted to say from my channel is um, not even a soul link um, comment, but it's from our interview that we did after our RCF battle. Mm -hmm. um, and um, it, it was, it was during the interview. Oh my gosh. Audacity. Stop it. Stop it. Audacity. Stop it. Bat. Oh my God. I hate everything. Stop it. Just, just stay there. Just stay there. And behave yourself. Um, uh, so Monk says, Goki Friday Season 4 confirmed! Hey, great interview, so wholesome. So I just wanted to add that, um, in there because, um, Monk thought our interview was very wholesome. And it, to be fair, it kind of was. We were just, we were just talking about random stuff for, like, 
30 minutes. That just goes to show you how clo- how like how strong our bond is. It's pretty great. much just like this episode. Initially, we were aiming yeah. for 15 minutes and we're already past yeah, the 15 minutes. Yeah, we've already minutes. talked for like a half hour. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we haven't even talked about the episodes themselves yet. We're just talking about the comments and anime. <laughs> and I haven't even watched any anime. <laughs> I know, right? Oh, this guy can great. keep up a conversation on not. He hasn't watched it. It's great, anything. dude. It's amazing. It's amazing. I love this guy. I love this guy. I yeah, no, I love this guy. I love this guy too. This guy's epic. Um, anyways, you want to read some of your comments? Uh, so on my side, I just like the love and support for my side. You know, everyone's like uh, Emily. My better one calling you Amelia. I've been watching too re zero, <laughs> too much re zero, and I'm just reading Amelia now. Oh my so, god. <laughs> Thanks for the support, Emily. Yeah, your boy is gonna win. Watch, your boy is gonna win with Latias. Nah, 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 n
What? And Onyx's is base 40. <laughs> it's so stupid. <laughs> what? The only reason Onyx is good is because he has like 110 defense or something like that. That's the only reason he's good. That's true. So, yeah, I know, right? It's, it's crazy. But, um, yeah, Onyx sucks in everything else. Uh, the only thing it works in is defense. And while it does get some decent moves, like it, it gets Screech, I think, early on. Um, I was just like, I'm not going to risk the quad weaknesses. I'm, I'm just not. And then also combine the fact that it's Spiel not being a primary water, but instead primary ice. That gives me, let's just be honest, that gives me a much rarer typing than Rock, which would have been much. Onyx. That, so I chose Spiel because it has God tier moveset. Um, in early game being it already has powder snow I think and I think it gets water gun really early on as well mm -hmm. um, and then on top of that it gets like moves like other moves like defense curl encore and stuff like that uh, it gives me primary ice which is a very rare typing um, and also season 2 that's a reference to season 2 baller is from season 2 because I had spiel in episode, in season two, uh, or well, no, it wasn't season two. No, it wasn't, never mind. It was season, technically season one of the Soul Versus, which is Heart Gold and Soul Silver. Mm -hmm. I had um, Spiel in that series as well. I think it was paired up with um, Gizmo's Farfetched. Or, no, that was Electabuzz and Farfetched. Uh, mm -hmm. I can't remember what this feel is. Oh, it was Spiel and Butterfree. I mean, not Butterfree, Beautyfly, I think. I think so. I think so. it was Spiel and Beautyfly. Um, so yeah, that was that was just amazing. Um, so that's why I chose Spiel. So do you want to talk about Slackoth and Latias? I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't even remember why I didn't choose Slackoth. I think it was because of the moveset. Oh wait, yeah, it just gets Scratch. That's that's all it gets until level 19, and Scratch ain't gonna cut it for for the gym actually. So yeah, I had well, better chances the gym with. Would be randomized, but you know. What do you mean? The the, the gym was randomized, so it would have been a uh, rock gym. It would have been randomized. But yeah, the only thing the the fact that I just have scratch. I mean, I think Stykoth is all around pretty good. I guess you could say. Uh, it's pretty good, and then like having a slacking late game is really freaking good, especially when abilities are randomized because uh, abilities are randomized. Mm -hmm. Um, so having a slacking that doesn't know true want as an ability that's really freaking good. Actually, I didn't think about that. But the only reason why I chose Latias was it was kind of a gamble because early on it just gets side wave. But once we get to level 20, it, it's just home run. Home run. Literally yeah. just home run. And then also combine the one fact shot. that you also have Wish as well, which gives you guaranteed healing, which means you don't have to spend as much money on potions. That also, that that really helped you, especially in the early game as well. Spoilers a little bit. But um, like even like already in Petalburg Woods, like I'm struggling you know, after watching, if you guys watched episode three, you guys know I was struggling, which we'll talk Pedalberg? about in a second. Pedalberg, man, Pedalberg, man, Pedalberg. The first trainer, Pedalberg, just freaking was a problem. Um, Wait, Pedalberg? Whatever, Ridian Forest, leave me alone. <laughs> I'm like, okay, wait. Leave wait, me are alone! We, wait, wait. <laughs> I was like, wait, hold up. In what world oh am I? <laughs> Did I just get transported you're, to another dimension or something? You're in Hoenn. Did you're I in miss Hoenn something? Now, baby. I transported you to Hoenn. <laughs> oh, jeez. I got Isekai to Hoenn. No. You got Isekai to Hoenn. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Oh, man. But yeah, right, then again, wanna, I knew about... I knew Slackoth was a definitely amazing mon too. It was a good grab. But I just saw the return on Slackoth, especially the fact that it levels up to 36. It's, nah, I was not going to do that. No. I yeah. had more fun with Latias. I had more fun with Latias, to be honest yeah. with you. Yeah. And also, another reason you I think another reason you chose Latias as well is because it gives you Primary Dragon, which is another very rare typing. So already out of the gate, we have Primary Ice and Primary Dragon. The We're rarest not going to get another pair like that. Whereas <laughs> if we chose something like Slackoth and Onyx, there'd be a very good chance we would get another Rock type or another normal type as an encounter. So I think that's another reason you chose Latias as well, is just because of that. Oh my god, Auda Audacity, stop! You need me to yell! Holy frick! Audacity, um, sorry. man. Audacity problems here. Audacity. The audacity of Audacity. Sorry, that was a bad joke. Um, but yeah, that was another reason I think why you chose Latias is because of the mm. dragon typing. <laughs> because it's primary for dragon, not primary psychic. So, actually, I think that, that I think that clutched it for me for actually choosing Latias at the end. So yeah, well, we'll see, we'll see. No kudos spoilers, to me. Kudos to no me. No spoilers, of course. No spoilers. But anyways, um, yeah, I think Latias was definitely the better pick overall for sure. But now, Based on how, like some of the series, the series played out. Um, but anyways, let's talk about um episode two, which is your end. Take it now, away. I <laughs> Now, episode two. Now, this episode was on my channel, and let me just say, encounters were real. Uh, route mm -hmm. one, already, I lead off with my starter that I decided to choose, 
was Latias, aka Alice, aka a shout out to SAO, uh, Sword Art Online. You, Goki Yo, already knows this. Baby. Goki yep. already knows this. Now, here is where it gets super wild. So, I go into the first route, and my encounters are just insane in itself. We get Torkoals. We have, I think the other one was uh, Lambre. But the one that was crazy enough for me to encounter was Latios. Can I can I just say what are the odds? Yeah, I mean, I remember that. I remember that, dude. That's crazy. Didn't I get Suicune as well? Wasn't there Suicune in my route? I believe I you had Raikou or something. Well, actually, I, 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 I had something. I think I had something. I think it was Suicune. Maybe it was Raikou though. I don't, well, yeah, maybe it was Raikou. Maybe it was Entei. It was one of the legendary beasts or dogs or cats or whatever you want to call them. But it was <laughs> I call very them legendary wild. beasts. I call it them legendary beasts. Wild. I don't care. Yeah, it was wild. I do remember that. I do remember that. Um, we also got some... I think that was the episode where we got all of our encounters, right? Because by the time episode 3 came out, like, we already had McCargo and Coughing and, like, all yeah. those ones. And we get introduced to our... Actually, in episode 2, we get introduced to the very legendary pair, I like to say. The McCargo and... Dare I say... McCargo and The Phoebus. The Phoebus. Oh, yeah, it was McCargo and Phoebus. My bad, yeah. Coughing no. and Voltorb were linked together, yeah. Oh, no. First off... Emily, be grateful that it gave, named you after after a Pokemon. Emily was roasting me uh, the other day, saying, "Why would you name a Bakargo after me?" And I'm just like, "Freak you! I named a Pokemon after you." So, but yeah, um, and I actually learned later on uh, a little bit in the early game. Um, Bakargo actually has a really good move set early on. It really, it, it really does. It had, it doesn't, it doesn't like mid to late game. It doesn't have a great move set, but I already have access to moves like Ember and Rock Throw, which is really, really good. So that, can that just... kind of surprised me. I didn't, okay. I didn't like having the primary fire that was weak to ground and water, but that that move set combined with spiels, water, and ice type attacks made it really, really made my team already rounding out really, really well. Which yep. is something that's very rare in a solo link. A which I really want to add on to that is like once we got our final pair for this episode and episode two was the Voltorb and Coughing. Can I just yeah. say, Goki, how does I don't know what gods are on your side, but on every single Soul Link, you name it, on the channel, we have all the playlists of every Soul Link. This guy has all around team, like synergy. And I just get. Yeah, I have synergy on my team. I don't. And I struggle. Just like, what I just struggle. Pokemon. <laughs> just I struggle. Yeah, it's, like, it's, really, it's really funny how that ends up working out because it's like. I I usually end up with a team that is like really good synergy overall, and Gizmo ends up with the one overpowered Pokemon, and then the rest of the team sucks. <laughs> it's so funny. I mean, to be fair, Coughing does put in work for you a little bit um, in the coming episodes, but um, to top it off, yeah, I definitely I definitely have a much better team overall, especially since like Voltorb can get Sonic Boom. Like I don't have an electric move yet, but I think I start off with Sonic Boom already, and I think I have Screech as well as Tackle, which is a great combination mm -hmm. as well. So and it gives me really fast Pokemon, gives me an electric type for later on down the line. It makes it really, really, it makes it a really, really good pair, um, for me, anyways. But you and know then, what? Um, you get coughing, so I get coughing. I get the trashy mon. Uh, I don't like to call I it trash. Because... You have a Latias, so you can't talk. I I, I can't you have a Latios, talk. So yeah, you can't. You can't or Latias. I got Latias. I got Latias. All right. Yeah. I will. I won't complain. I won't complain. Yeah. Especially the fact that we found out that my Latias is timid. Not. It's oh, not, yeah. it That's doesn't specialize in special attack, but it does bump up my speed, so. And lowers your attack, which you never use on a Latias anyways. So Latias. you had like the sec, you had the second best ability, you had the second best nature in the entire game on your Latias for this yep. one. It was wild. It was beautiful. And I think that was the thing for me too, beautiful. like my natures usually sucked. I remember that. Uh, I, th I think at least. I think my natures were pretty bad. And my, and my abilities weren't the best either. If I have to say anything, I think this time around in Season 3, I definitely have one of the best team-ups out of all my seasons in Soul Link. Uh, yeah. Not to mention Season 2, I think. I think it was Season 2 or 1, uh, where we went to yeah, Heart Gold and Soul Silver. That was Season 1. That'd be Season 1, because Blaze Black and Bolt White was Season 2. Oh yeah, back in Season 1. I think Season 1 was literally the only time I had an all-around good team. But you know what? That only lasted for, what, one episode? And then they all died. <laughs> I think. Yeah, and then they all died to Red <laughs> uh, Sad times. Well, technically, all but one died to Red Gigas, and then I died because I ran into Goku was stupid. Type, because you killed. No! I was Goku not was stupid. stupid. Goku not was stupid. Not traded at two ghost types. I didn't have any TMs that I could teach my Pokemon, so therefore it's your fault. I uh, literally was running to Goldenrod <laughs> to get TMs for my Pokemon, so that way that situation wouldn't happen, and it happened. It's not my fault, because you lost all of our good pairs. 
Wink, wink. That I is like how getting this guy triggered. Links. No, literally, both season one and season two, I will forever stand by this. We lost because you lost all of our good pairs, and then I get screwed over, so I end up losing the luck because I didn't have my good bot mods on my team because you lost all of them to your stupidity. So, frick you, Gizmo, Gizmo, Gio, whatever your freaking name is, if that is your real name. <laughs> <laughs> and that wraps up episode two we literally just got the three main mods for this week's episodes and <laughs> yeah we get we get we get our pair for the first gym we get our pairs for the first gym in that episode mm-hmm. we even get the pichu backup pair as well I, I was like pichu and something I, else it wasn't it wasn't great so we didn't add it on obviously but i think i got combuskin i think it was the Pichu. yeah you got combuskin i was like no i'm keeping voltorb <laughs> i was like nah i'm keeping voltorb this guy hates me this guy doesn't doesn't want me to get power uh well, i have listen, nothing against you have a Latias, i think i have I, you have a Latias, i think i have priority when it comes to picking pairs true, i'm letting you keep that Latias, so you know what uh, you could do whatever you want with the feebas Feel free to grill it for me. Feel free. Yeah. Feel free. You know, you're not wrong there. You're not You're not wrong. I'll grill it with my Bacargo. How about that? <laughs> all, right, all right. All right. Uh, <laughs> so let's move on to okay. episode three. All right. Episode three. Uh, the lost recording episode. So I talk about this in the beginning of the episode, but what happened during this episode was my computer shut down about 20 minutes in. It just randomly rebooted itself. It's only happened twice. There, I can't remember the first... I think the first time I was just chilling and it just randomly happened and I was like, well, that was weird. Um, but then it happened in the recording for episode three and so I lost everything. I lost my gameplay, but I still had my audio, thankfully. I don't know how that works, but it worked somehow. Um, let's see here. Um, and it hasn't happened since... By the way, for an update on that situation, it has not happened since then. So I don't know what, that, what was going on there. It just randomly restarted itself. And it has not happened since then. That's the only time it's, that those are the only two times it's ever happened. So I don't know what happened in that particular scenario, but thankfully at least it kept my audio. At the very least, my audio was saved, so that's good. Goku, um, I have a question for you. What? What's? What's with that face, though? <laughs> what's with that face? Listen, we. I thought it was funny. <laughs> I, oh. I, 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 oh, geez. I thought it was funny. Okay. I had nightmares that night. I had nightmares. <laughs> oh my god. I got I got Wait, scarred. Fair, I don't blame you. That's that would be my that would be your sleep paralysis demon. That makes sense. Oh jeez, no. Chunky Please don't Goki. bring it to this world. Chunky Goki. I don't know what it is about applying like filters on my face. It's so funny. I don't know why, but I love it. It's so great. <laughs> such huge cringe. Cringe. I am such huge cringe. I am such huge cringe, am I right? Yep. Um the other, th- uh, there were two other things I wanted to talk about. I remember you were struggling. I remember at one point you said something about struggling against Astonish and you were being scared, but you were literally fighting a Swablu with a Latias, so you were fine. <laughs> I know. I get scared I for that. everything. I get you scared get, you for You literally every- get scared for everything. You'll notice this. This is a trend. He gets scared of everything, and then I freak out, and then he's just like, oh, we're fine. And I'm just like, freak you, you moron. <laughs> <laughs> It's, it's 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 great, man. It's great. I think I, I've been scarred for the last five seasons. We've done this. I've been scarred for everything. Honestly, yeah, you're I've not been hugely scarred. Scarred. You you just you just react to everything. And like I, when I react to problems, at least they're legitimate. <laughs> at least they're legitimate. Like I might get swept problems, <laughs> and then I'm, and then like usually what I'll do is R and Jesus will be on my side, and then I'll be fine. And then Gizmo will be like, oh, you had us worried for no reason when you literally comment over a swaddle using a. Stop I'm trying to lie to us. That ain't doing crap to you, dude. <laughs> Goki, can we admit that I make every easy situation just super difficult for myself? Just admit you that. You do. You really do. And it stresses me out. <laughs> I don't know in what I, point. I get gray hairs when we record these series just because of you freaking out over this stuff. <laughs> I don't know no in reason. what episode it is. I don't know what episode. I know it's one of these episodes or in the future where I literally exaggerate about a small mon, a small problem. And I'm there for like 10 <laughs> minutes. I'm like, Goki. What do I do? Goki, what do I do? And it's just something simple like, and I kill it off. <laughs> and I just kill it off in one shot. And I was like, oh, never mind, Goki. <laughs> Proceed with <Just, laughs> whatever yeah, you were doing. It's, it's, and then I'm just like, wow, you, you, you made me stress for like half the episode when you didn't need to be stressed about it. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm fighting a Pokemon with Wonder Guard here and I don't have a Pokemon to hit it. <laughs> you know, <whatever>. Spoiler alert, <laughs> Goki. <laughs> Actually. Well, no, listen, I didn't say that it happened. Although it might have happened. Or did it oh, not oh, happen? Oh, 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 oh. To be but, fair, maybe it did happen. Wonder Guard Swablu? Wonder Guard yeah, Swablu. I dude, see that it. That would have been crazy. Ooh. That would have been crazy, dude. 
Um, Goki. But anyways, um, <laughs> definitely not hinting toward the future. <laughs> <coughs> 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 anyways, um, uh, so the other thing I wanted to talk about was um, the one battle I got stuck in for like 10 minutes of that session being my fight with Feraligator and Ludicolo. Oh, God, <laughs> was that a stressful fight? Ooh, oh I remember God. that one. That was, all, that was also the first fight where we implemented the kind of like safe state for us where we were allowed to like look stuff up um, because we were like, we're not losing the Sonic versus we're not losing it. So we were like, should I look it up? And guess what was like, just look it up. I was like, I don't know. And guess what was just like, freaking I'm looking it up for you. I was like, okay, that definitely saved me throughout that fight because I would have figured Ludicolo had water gun, but um, yeah. Um, and then the Frogator came in, I could just 1v1 and it was feel, but yep. um yeah, that was stressful. <laughs> this guy was terrified that for his life. That was a stressful life. fight. That was a stressful fight. Um, and it, it, it's interesting to see what would have happened. Because uh, for those of you who don't know as well, when my computer rebooted, it also made me lose all my save files. It made, it made me lose the save file. So I had to restart from the beginning of the episode. So I had to do like I had to spend like uh, a few minutes grinding to get to back to where I was. Uh, which, didn't, which took like five, ten minutes. Um... And we got back but on the then grind. I got back to that's why I ended up at the beginning of the fight was because along with my losing my recording I also lost where I was in the game so I had to um, do that all that again which yep. was unfortunate but um, in a way it kind of saved me because going into it and having the knowledge that I knew um, just helped me a lot so I completely I don't know, forgot about I don't that know if I would have lost we probably would have at least the bare minimum lost a pair but I doubt we, I would have actually <laughs> lost the luck mm-hmm you know, um, Goki. I like the, I like the fact that uh, the fact that throughout this whole entire episode, I'm literally just grinding, chilling, just chilling, just straight chilling, and then you're just like struggling beyond belief. <laughs> no, legitimately. I mean, dude, you have a lot of us on your team. You're chilling. I'm the one who has to try to get ahead while I can, because I because it's like, and we talk about this. I think I don't I don't remember if we talk about this in episodes like three or four, or like if it's later on. But the second you get Dragon Pulse on Latias, you start you you get ahead of me. Like you're going to get ahead of me. So it's a matter of me trying to get as big of a lead as I can, so that way I can try to keep up with you once you do get Dragon Pulse, because then I'll have a team that actually can like keep up with you. That's kind of what I'm trying to do, so I have to struggle to try to get ahead as fast as I can. And actually, going back on something that Goki, I exaggerate so much that I don't realize Ladia's potential until very, very, very far into the series. And I look yeah. at Ladia's stats and I'm like, oh, that's why Goki told me not to worry about it. I am such an <laughs> idiot. <laughs> okay, why wow, don't I? Wow, I'm such a moron. <laughs> Yes. Yeah, I mean, it's a lot. It's a lottie. It's a lottie. Of course, it's good. <laughs> Early you underestimate game. the power of legendaries, Gizmo. You underestimate it. Uh, dude, is... imagine you found a soul dew. If you imagine you found a soul dew, dude. This would have been, been game. That would have been, been game. To be fair, you already have a broken item on it, right? Uh, Isn't is this the episode where you, is, don't you have like OP item on it? Now, like by this point? Uh, no. The only thing I really had, I started off with lefties. That's all I really started. That was off. the OP item. That was the OP item. That was the OP item. Early on, that but honestly, about. that really just slowed me down, uh, and that's why I decided to take it off later on. Spoiler alert. Uh, <laughs> I think I did on episode four or five. I don't remember, but it was one yeah, of those. Yeah, I, I don't remember. It was one of the two. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, uh, but oh. anyways, that's it for episode three on my end. So um, we were just struggling. <laughs> Pretty much. Well, now, you were fake struggling. I was actually struggling. <laughs> so, uh, do you want to talk about episode four? Yep. Starting uh, off with we've been, we've been going for fifty minutes, so we need to try to pick this up a bit. <laughs> All right. Yeah. So, going off uh, real quick, two things I really just want to talk about in this. Well, actually, it's three things. So, real quick, uh, episode four is the first introduction to the second opening, kind of one point five opening of the series. So, let me know what you guys thought. That was like literally a beta of the final opening that will be releasing for episode five, which will be coming out tomorrow, which is on Goki's side. If he's... Yeah, baby. So according to Goki, he likes the he likes the new opening. I like it because it's uh, a lot of Easter eggs in there. <clears throat> cough, cough. Exactly. Uh, <coughs> Easter eggs on it. <laughs> so that was the one thing I really want to talk about. The second thing is in this episode, all we really did was pretty much grind. Now I don't blame you for not wanting wanting to watch episode four. It is just <laughs> grinding. But what makes episode yeah. four really worthy of watching is this is where me and Goki started 
to talk about our childhood backstories a little. <laughs> Oh so, yeah, I remember that. We went full on like history about our lives in that episode. I forgot about that. <laughs> That's why we I titled the episode. Oh yeah, that's why. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. I haven't even forgotten about that. Oh yeah, I was talking about how I was the loser kid. <laughs> Basically, I was the loser kid growing up. Oh my god. I was a socially awkward kid who nobody liked for some reason. Every like even though I was like I tried to be nice. I was like, I was nice to people and nobody would talk to me. And I was just sad and depressed. It was sad. It was so sad. Honestly, the same. <laughs> I remember that. Yeah, that was a rip. Yeah, that was funny. That was funny. Do we do we actually get through Pedalberg? I mean, Pedal I said Pedalberg. Do we actually get through Viridian Forest in that episode? I can't remember. I can't remember if we actually got through that. Ep we did. <laughs> oh my god. It's, it's, it's Pedalberg. Listen, it's Pedalberg Woods, okay? Let's just call it as it is. It's Pedalberg Woods. It's that. We're calling it Pedalberg now. We're calling it Pedalberg. Frick it. Oh, my God. Yeah. So, I think... Yeah, I think episode five, we might be taking... I might, Or at least I might be taking on the gym. I can't remember. I think I do... Yeah, no, I still haven't edited it. We don't talk about that. Uh... <laughs> I'm editing it tomorrow, okay? Leave me alone. Listen, don't worry about it. Frick you! Shame, 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 shame. Have you edited any of your episodes yet? Oh. Well, um. <laughs> okay. Well, you're ahead of me. Dang it. Um. Okay! <laughs> Um, I don't think so. This was went on a lot longer than we both of us anticipated. I was into, I, yeah, that's what I was thinking too. And then went on for like double that. That was crazy, dude. It just goes to show you how like we can talk about anything and everything and make it worthwhile for us. <laughs> Honestly, yeah. What, what what you could do is what you could do is you could do the um. The timestamp thing, where you have like the timestamps in the description, and then it like appears on the video like timeline as like chapters. So you could do that. Yeah, no, that thing is a lifesaver, dude. It's so good. It's a bit too late to say that now. It's a bit too late to say that now, but you know. <laughs> if you made it, okay, wait. If you made it to this point, if you made it to this point, comment burgers. <laughs> just comment burgers. Just, just you know, just, just add it somewhere in your comment, okay? Just, just, just put like, oh, and also burgers or something like that. Just, just do that, okay? We'll see how many. We'll see how many of you guys are real. We'll, su we'll, see, we'll see how many of you guys are real. On Gizmo's channel. We're both busy, let's be honest. <laughs> I think, yeah, that, that's, well, frick you. That's why you're editing these episodes, not me. <laughs> well, listen, 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 listen. I will make time, I'll make. I'll definitely be able to make time for these episodes, for sure. Like, I, I, like, Saturdays I'm pretty free, usually. So, I can do, like, most Saturdays, if not every Saturday. Or Friday. Yeah, I've had a lot of fun too. I've had a lot of fun talking with you. Um, next next week's stuff, we'll be talking about episodes five through eight, and we'll be reading comments. Do you have any more clarifications that we need to do? Talk about other random stuff, uh, most likely anime. <laughs> uh, we'll see though. We'll see how it works out. Uh, but yeah, that'll be that'll be what'll be going on from that episode on. 
<clears throat> Excuse me. Yes! Yeah. And also, let us know if you guys would like to see this even after the song versus ends. Let us know if you'd like to see our podcast with me and Gizmo. The Gioki Podcast. Or something like that. The Gioki Podcast. Something like that. I don't know. That's just a random name I came up with. <laughs> yeah, baby! Sounds like a plane. Peace out, mates!